Well, this is our big annual fundraiser. It's, um, it's also part of Newham College's student awards ceremony, so there's a lot of very proud students and parents here tonight getting awards. It's absolutely wonderful to see so many people, so many young people and older people, um, all the different nationalities we work with, the different types of students, to see those that have worked really hard come up and win those awards. I'm just, you know, it's a real honour to be a small part of it. We use it to generate funds through uh, companies sponsoring the different awards and we use the money raised to provide financial support for disadvantaged students in the form of bursaries and other schemes. It was a really inspiring event. The great thing about Shining Stars was recognising in a very public way the extraordinary achievements of our learners and the obstacles they've overcome. They mean everything for these young people because often um, they're young people who didn't particularly um, do brilliantly at school, um, missed out the first time round, if you like. Um, they may be young people who come from different countries around the world and um, are looking to make their way in, in, in the UK, uh, having often come from countries of conflict and, and so on. Um, so you're, you've really got people, young people here who've achieved a huge amount, often from a very difficult start. So uh, these awards are very, very meaningful to, to the young people con concerned tonight. I was hoping to win. We've been working so hard and it was like amazing that our hard work has been recognised. So that is what's most important to me, that everything that we do is not being watched to just go, but they are recognising it and that's the most important part of it. It means a lot for me because it shows that I worked really hard and it's really nice. It means that um, my hard work and my achievements are seen by others in the college and they're acknowledged. It has a remarkable impact on their confidence, on their professional bearing, on their ability to do public speaking and to step up to higher challenges. Their awards are recognised in front of many local businesses, so they are increasing their exposure to professionals who are seeing the calibre of students that, um, that come out of Newham College. It's a real win-win situation. Employers are seeing the potential of the talent that is available to support them as they develop their businesses and our learners are getting exposure to the businesses that could well be providing jobs for them in the future. The LRT helped me for support me to, with money to come to college and uh, the college, the teachers, they helped me a lot because I couldn't speak normally, I was really shy and they give me confidence. I think they've supported us really good. Um, we've been put on platforms. They have given us the chance to exhibit our skills and everything we've done, they have supported, supported us from scratch. So I think they have really put in us on the platform to showcase what we can do. It's really optimistic at the moment because a lot of other colleges in East and South East London are joining us. And this means that we can become uh, a charity which covers the whole of East London and South East London, helps a lot more students financially than it does at the moment and also develops more clout in the policy area and is able to develop, uh, to, to speak to local authorities, central government and others to develop policies that are more favourable to the people that we're trying to help. Yeah, I'd say congratulations to every student tonight, whether you're highly commended or whether you won. And I'd also say to students who might be watching this who didn't get nominated or uh, haven't been nominated before or are new to the college, I'd say this is a chance to show what you can do. The harder you work, the more you apply yourself, the more dedication you show to your studies, then the more likely you are to be rewarded at Shining Stars. Mm -hmm.